Lou and Brasserie was our very first restaurant. It opened election day, November 3rd, 1992. It was unique in that what we did in the very beginning uh, was serve dinner till four in the morning. And we did it at a level that no one else had ever seen before. We're nominating James Shrum, our bartender, who's been with us since day one and before as employee of the month. If you look up Blue Ribbon in the dictionary, it says James Shrum. I personally like to drink margaritas. I always have, I always will. I'm James Shrum. I'm a uh, bartender at Blue Ribbon and a partner at the restaurant. He is very, very special. He is Blue Ribbon. He helped build this restaurant. He has set, you know, the benchmark for hospitality for us. When I first met Eric Bromberg back in 1987, he wanted people to, uh, you know, to leave his place happy. That's a standard that he has, he and his brother Bruce and the entire team here have maintained from the very beginning. James is a warm-hearted, open arms, you know, individual who lives life to its fullest and uh, he loves people, he loves taking care of people. The position that I have here, literally, I see people walking in the door and as soon as they walk in, I'm one of the first faces that they see of, of Blue Ribbon and I think it's important um, because of that to make them feel welcome. I mean, we're in the hospitality industry, that's what we do. People look for him, people rely on him, people ask about him. He really is sort of in that category of the world's most interesting man. He has more than just bartending skills and what he gives is superior, especially in this industry. He's up there in the top echelon of people doing what they do. The one time this, this, uh, this really drunk guy thought James was a professional wrestler, <laughs> he was in pretty rough shape and he was convinced James was his arch enemy. When you're at St. Patrick's Day, um, three o'clock in the morning. It was one of the most outrageous things I've ever seen. Between two o'clock and four o'clock in the morning, you have a lot of interesting situations. That was one of them. James has been an integral part of, you know, determining what Blue Ribbon is to so many different people and to, to all of us. There's so many uh, critical people that make a successful restaurant happen. And James is a great example of that. It's an honor to be recognized by people that you respect and people that you work with on a regular basis. It's pretty humbling. He is Blue Ribbon, and people come to Blue Ribbon to be taken care of by James.